Tonight, people across the world are dealing with the impacts of the coronavirus. When it comes to workers, though, some groups are being hit harder financially than others. News 8's Monique Griego explains why. Well, the La Valencia Hotel here in La Jolla is just one of many businesses and hotels in the service and hospitality industry that recently had to lay off a lot of its employees. And because Latinos make up a big part of that workforce, historically it has shown that they have suffered financially the most during times like this. While there's no denying every community throughout the nation and world is struggling to deal with the coronavirus pandemic, when it comes to U.S. workers as a whole, new research shows one group tends to be hit especially hard financially. So a lot of Latinos tend to generate into the hospitality restaurant industry. Iris Garcia is the president and CEO of the San Diego Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. It seems that we're the most affected, and at the same time, we're the longest. It, uh, it takes us the longest to recover from it as well. A study done last month by the Pew Research Center showed Hispanics are more concerned about the threat of the virus to their health and financial situation, due to the fact that around 66% don't have jobs with the ability to work from home and therefore earn a paycheck. As this is a very unusual uh, moment in history where Americans who live paycheck to paycheck have to go without a paycheck for more than a month. Back in the Great Recession more than a decade ago, research also showed the household wealth among Hispanics dropped by 66 percent, the largest of all racial groups. Still, Garcia knows they are by far not the only community suffering during these times. It seems to be a trend across the board. It's, it's about survival right now. And if you'd like more information on resources that can help people right now, just go to our website, cbsstate.com, and click on the hot button. Monique Griego, News 8.